Welcome back guys. We are ready to head out on a new mission. Um, Freebie and Bengal are injured, which sucks, but it is what it is. We don't have great missions here. We have a one and a half skull blackout. The last blackout we went on kind of sucked. Uh, and then we have a defend base which I don't have great experience with, uh, but we're going to do it. We're going to take all of the salvage. Everything is ready. Everyone is ready, except for our two wounded guys. Sin is at least is getting some experience. So, so that's good. That's good. And uh, we're going to deploy. Let's go. Let's go. All right, uh, we are heading out. So uh, I'll see you guys when we're at drop. All right, guys, we are on station. Let's get down there and do the space defense. Oof. There's a lot of water here. Okay. So we need to... Destroy the enemy vanguard over there. We need to escort the engineers. All right, so I think we will drop here close to the base and we'll see what happens. I mean, they should be made, able to make it okay. We see a J. Edgar. Kabuto, a hitman, and a goblin. Okay. Well. No shooting. Just running. Booger. It's never those two start out first. That's a little funny. Guardian Museum on. You don't really need to sprint. Right. Just move and brace. Alright. Goblin. Two alarm tens and a machine gun. Hitman. A bunch of energy and some kind of missiles. The Caputo just has a streak as I'm four. Not a problem. And the Jet Edgar is not really a problem either. Okay. Now the question is, where will they come in next? Probably down this direction, maybe. Uh, let's just move over here. Just spread out a little bit. I think with what they've got right now, we, we're not really in trouble. But we do, yeah, so four must survive, eight remain. That shouldn't be a problem. It's more when you can just you lose one building and things turn to crap. I don't like that. All right. They have a long way to go before they get in here, so our turns aren't going to get online for a while. Right now, let's come in here. Let's see what's easier to hit. Well, it's definitely the Caputo. Capu Caputo? Caputo? Uh, let's do that. And fire. You didn't like that, did you? Steamer dock. Well, let's see. What do we have? 
Well, the only place we can fire everything is there, so we'll hit the Kabuto. Big slide. Fire. That's a Kabuto down. Uh, Batangas. Let's just move in here. Ooh, that's a nice hit chance on the hitman. And on the goblin. I think I'll hit the goblin. Sin. Let's see. Well, the MRM-20s are really good on that. Well, let's just fire the MRM-20s. Just put some damage on that thing. Booger. Uh, hmm. All right, I guess we'll hit you. Hit man. Okay. So far, so good. Need to hold for ten rounds. But I don't think that's a problem. At least not yet. Rolling. Wow, that goblin is a really nice target. Ready. Big sly. Can you kick that guy? You can. 50% hit chance. I'll take it. Onward. We'll try it. Miss. does put him at risk but it's fine we'll be fine right we'll be fine yeah yeah we'll be fine all right that goblin has really not done itself any favors has it we do not need the rockets and we don't need okay I'm out goblin gone Jed go gone booger Can only move one because of this dang water. But this is a good hit chance. Yes, Patangus. I think these guys are done. Roger. Yep. That's that. Ooh, almost. Almost in, almost in. Okay, let's head back to base. Uh, just to... Be around here when the next wave comes in. Alright. Right, they're coming in there. That's fine. Steam it, Doc. What do we have? We have a Phoenix Hawk. 
with ER Large lasers and medium pulse lasers. We have another Phoenix Hawk with a lot of medium and small laser. We have a Hunchy with a Rack 10. Ouch. That's scary. And a Weevil. Alright, Hunchy is our main target. So if we move over here, uh, I, I think we're, we're going to wait until they've moved. There's something else. Yep. Down there. Okay. Blackjack, Shadowhawk. They're definitely going to take some buildings down. Hollander. And the Daimyo. What's a Daimyo? A 40 tonner. Hollander is a 35 tonner. Shadowhawk is a 55 tonner. Blackjack, 50 tonner. 45, 45, 50, and 25. Okay. Well, I'm still waiting until they've done their thing. Okay. They are doing damage to the buildings. No doubt about that. For the right move. I don't like that prowler. But now I think we can get in here and do start doing some damage now. Yeah. Please don't blow up my prowler. Because I wanted to get in there. Alright. Uh, let's go for this then. Since it's the best hit chance. Get in here. Let's grab you. Fire the bolt on rockets as well. Well, we destroyed an arm. We destroyed an arm. Big sly. You really can't move that far, can you? We're going for you. Steamer duck. No, I don't want you to jump. I want you to sprint. We need to get over here so that we can start firing on these guys as well. They're really far away. Booger. Uh, perfect range. I think we might take him down here. No. We destroyed a lower hand. <laughs> well, that's something, I guess. That's a lot of damage to that building, man. Punchy is really the most dangerous target. Sin. But if we can take you down, that's useful. And we can. Big Sly. I really want to hit the Hunchy. 
I guess we're going for the Phoenix. Because we could fire everything there. Well, it's kind of something that they went for him. Well, that's by far the best hit chance. It was a good hit. Uh, there goes that. So you're going on turn 12. Just get in there, please, so that we get the base defenses up and running. We'll survive, I hope. The Weevil. Well, we can afford some of the buildings to go down. We're going for Hunchy here. Let's switch to LK. Get as many hits in there as we can. He's unsteady. And now it's our ally's turn, and he's getting in there. Beautiful. So our turrets are on nine. I'm receiving you. Location confirmed. Fire. Fire Booger. Get in here and fire. I really wanted to get him on knocked down, but no dice. A friendly structure has been yep, destroyed. there goes the building. Wow, that was a big hit. This is a little scary. A little scary. Yeah. All right. Ooh, nice. And she is open and unsteady. So I think we're going punchy here. Fire. Well, oh, he has a battle armor on board. No, that was claws, not battle armor claws. All right, he punched out. So that's a mech. That's a that's a decent mech. That is a decent mech. Don't necessarily like that we put our backs to them. I think that was a mistake. Jesus. Big Sly. Come on, coming down this way. We need to get down to tackle the other guys. Right, but they destroyed an arm. Oof. That sniper turret is going down, man. But it's better than the buildings. All right, booger. All right, come back here and take that shot. 
All right. He's open. The daimyo seems to just have one large laser or something like that. Alright. Just turn like that. Not the greatest hit chance. But we certainly did hit. Alright. It's the weevil. Yeah, go ahead. Knock yourself out. And then it's something down here. The Shadowhawk. Clan. I think it's a clan Shadowhawk. Because it has C. Good hits on the blackjack. Bad miss on the jack blackjack. Good hits on the blackjack. All right. Big slide. You're gonna come down this way. I really don't want you to face that direction. So let's come down here. Because we need you to get in there. Well, we hit him. Yep. Somewhat. Right, this should take him out. Phoenix Hawk. You can say bye bye. I think we'll just go standards. We don't need more than that. Steamer duck. You're not the longest range guy. You do have some range, but not the longest range. So why don't you hit the weevil? All right, he ejected. Beautiful. Uh, Batangus. Who do you want to hit? Well, I think you're going to go for the blackjack. Good hit. Sin. The only thing we can fire is the MRMs. And the best hit chance is on the Hollander. Booger. I love that name, Booger. It's so tasty. All right, blackjack. Yeah, we already lost a building, so we can afford three more to go down. Doesn't matter. There goes a sniper turret, which is annoying, but to be expected. Time you're taking some missiles. All right, he's open. Probably on the arm, but it is what it is. They're not going to move in, so we're just going to move in for them, I guess. Well, we're going to, to move in on them. 
3.4 seems to be one of the best hit chances. Gauss rifle crit, nice. Tangus. All right, there goes his arm and the Gauss. Fifty-one. It was a hit. Big slide. All right. Well, we destroyed his shoulder. Well, the blackjack really isn't much of a threat anymore. I think we're going to go for the Hollander here. Alright. He has a Gauss too. Shot our friend, that's fine. Shadowhawk. Not too scary. He has a double heatsink kit. Alright. Steamer duck. Move in. Well, you can hit him. Left leg down. Lovely. That's a knockdown. I wish he'd have punched out, but it is what it is. Uh, let's go for the blackjack. Engine crit. Uh, you can't really shoot at anything from back there. Which is quite frustrating, frustrating actually. Uh, Batangas. Uh, well, let's go for the blackjack. Alright, Indian destroyed. Beautiful. Big slide. Decent. With just five LRMs. Booger. I kind of want to hit the Hollander. Alright, we just tried a heat sink. Booger has taken quite a bit of damage. I didn't notice that before. Need to be a little bit careful with him. That's the daimyo down. The heat, I think the heat sink kit double survived, which we need. Yes, 
That's you gone. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And Batangus. Come in here. Fire. That's him open. Sin. I think there's decent salvage here. Well, AC5 clans. LBX AC5s, that is. I think they're going down now, though. Yeah. You're screwed, buddy. Well, we got a leg. We got a leg. And he blew up. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. That went exceedingly well. That went exceedingly well. Very, very nice. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And I think there's some good salvage here. I think there's some good salvage here. 389,000. So there's a blackjack. Omni. a 50 tonner both the heatsink and the engine are destroyed though but a 50 ton blackjack omni that could be nice the hitman we're not getting so let's just disassemble you then there's a hunchback 50 tonner. Rack 10 risk that is crit but not destroyed. Light engine. A prototype heatsink kit. That's not bad. There's the Phoenix Hawk. Where the heatsink kit is destroyed. Unfortunate. Other than that, there isn't really much. The Weevil. Okay. What else is here? Calm Sweet Plus, not bad. Mask for the money. 1.2 million. We already have one, right? Yeah. Alarm clan ammo. Sensors recon. Patchwork materials. Okay. Alarm 5 clan. I think I might take that blackjack. Omni blackjack with focus fire plus one arm mind of accuracy plus one defense at 40. That's not bad. The hunchback plus two right torso accuracy and minus one recoil. That's not bad either. And a gyro melee plus plus hit sync kit prototype. Engine core 250 still intact. Engine light still intact. Rack 10 more or less intact. Uh, 
I think we're taking you. One plus twenty one. Do we take the blackjack? I mean, it's an Omni. It's a better bloody mech, isn't it? And it's cheaper in parts. We're taking blackjack. Combat shotgun, your medium laser clan, LRM5 clan, rack 10 risk. That's a really nice weapon. It's heavy, but it's a nice weapon. Calm sweet plus claws, three endo in a stack, engine light. Gyro Milli plus plus, which is really nice. I'll take that heatsink kit. Um, so we have six picks. So we have four left, so we can take that and the rack 10. Oops. I like the EO medium and laser clan as well. But if we took that and this ammo, then we have two picks left. The patchwork materials are really nice too. Mask is 1.2 million that we could sell. Gyro Mali plus plus is nice. Two fifty engine core. Com suite plus. Ooh. Choices, choices, choices. I think we'll take the gyro melee and the mask. Confirm. What else do we get? Uh, a goblin part, Holland apart, a feeding salt part, an LRM5. We have 11 of them. Rack 10, the engine ICs can go. You staying, you staying. Jump jet small can go. The mask is going. TSM. Mm. We'll keep that. And the rack 10 ammo. All right. It's a pretty good haul, though. It's a pretty good haul. I like it. I'll see you guys back on the Argo. All right, we're back. Castile took some jump point from no faction. Okay. We didn't get any of the Gausses, unfortunately. If they had been there, I would have taken them. Okay. Uh, let's see. Phoenix Hawk. That is right. Let's take a look at this new uh, 50 tonner. Which in reality means that we don't need the fire starter. But we'll keep, we can have it as a backup. So replace all that. The heatsink kit double didn't make it either, unfortunately. We could make this an LRM boat. What are its quirks? 
quirks? Why do I see the quirks? I think I can't see them in here. I don't remember. Oh, here. Plus one arm mounted accuracy, plus one defense. Okay. Comes with a C3 slave as well, which isn't bad. So if we strip that, armor it up. Then we can stick in We don't have proto any prototype heat sinks, which sucks. So we could stick that in there. And then FCS missile accuracy. If we wanted to go down the LRM route. So something like that. Calm sweet. You already have an XL engine. You could have a Guardian ECM. Have sensors range. And then for weapons, so it was right arm accuracy plus one arm mark mounted accuracy. So we could do that. And that that would be fifty LRMs. So we'd certainly take the LRM LK. So it's 120 shots. Uh, I mean, we have two F FTLs. Now we're way over weight though, which is not great. Mm-hmm. And we don't have the heat sinks. So we need an engine heat sink plus two or something. So we could do that. That would be 240. So that would be mean almost no shots fired. I mean, four alpha strikes. The heat is fine, but we need more heat sinks. And we don't have them. We do not have him. And this just screws us. All right, it's a sweet mech, but we can't run it right now because we're missing some heat sinks. Hmm.
But it would be a sweet, 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 sweet mech. Our problem is heat sinks. Dang it. Well, heat sink kits and heat sinks. If we just had some heat sinks, we'd be fine. If we go to the store, can we buy an HS plus two? Engine heat sink plus two. Buy. So that would mean uh, what's an LRM ten delta? LRM times ten. Okay. What's a regular LRM? Five times ten, eight heat. 50% chance to misfire. Hits cluster towards same location. Yeah. Missile HP plus one. So that's something that's better with you. Eight percent anti-air, eight percent anti-air. So that's basically it. Missile has a plus one HP. So if we stick in you in you in there, we'll stick you in there. We'll stick you in there, and we'll stick you in there. Or let's see, LRM fifteen weighs three tons. LRM ten weighs two tons. Okay. So what if we did something like this and then give you the uh, the pharaoh. We're still way overweight. As in way way I don't think the gyro reduces weight, does it? No. We can't even put it in there. We need the engine heatsink plus two. So we're way overweight with this. Why? They only weigh two tons, don't they? No, five tons. They weigh seven. So... The fifteens are actually more efficient. We could also just are the fives two tons the fives are more efficient and we have tons of slots don't we so we could do something like that That would work. We put that in. Actually, let's put that in. We still have almost nine tons to work with. So we could upgrade some of them to tens or something. Potentially. 
You could also put an Artemis attachment in and use those two as Artemis. I don't think we have any more Artemis attachments than the one. We do actually. Uh, can be attached to maximum of one per weapon. So it's not ideal with the LRM5s. It's really not. Okay. So, if we took out two of you, put in one of you, and one of you, then we wouldn't have enough room for ammo. So we do that instead to get the room for ammo. Or the weight for ammo. We of course need the engine heat sink kit. Oh, okay. So then we need heat sinks in there. We need three hit heat sinks in there. All right, in that case, we'll put in the LRM5 instead. Put in some heat sinks. And there, then put in the Com Suite Plus Plus, the FCS missile accuracy, direct fire missiles. Do we want the indirect, or do I want the multi-track? I, I, I'd kind of like to do direct fire, so it's 10, 20, 30, 40. 45 LRMs. So we can't do this. We can't do this. We have to do uh, this. Or this. This is fine. Then uh, I actually think having a hmm. A Bloodhound probe or a Beagle probe would be kind of nice. And then some ammo. Well, uh, actually sensors. Sensors. Uh, we want sensors range, I think. And then some LRM ammo, so we can do LRM LK, regular LRM, uh, not Artemis, LRM FTL, and another ton of regular LRM. And then we still have a little bit of weight left. So this would be 480 ammo 
and we are firing 45 so that's just over 10 alpha strikes which is fine another ton of ammo wouldn't hurt So put a ton of ammo in there and then reduce a little bit of armor. And then we have a pretty decent mech. And it'll only take 10 days to get ready. That's quite nice. And it's a long range monster. Well, not a monster, it's only alarm fives, but still, still. Yeah. I like it. I like it. Oh, uh, I forgot about the overweight, but we are, um, oops, we're a long ranger, right? So we just take it off the back mainly. Do that. Do something like that. Yeah. Valid. Confirm. Confirm. And that's a new 50 tonner. Which basically replaces the Firefly. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Cool. All right. Cool, 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 cool. But we're out of time for now. So uh, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe? And I'll see you next time.